Hey, it's Lane with Windows10Update.com, and today we're actually going to be talking about disabling Windows 10 updates. Every so often, there's going to be an update that Microsoft pushes out that breaks the operating system for some people. There are many different reasons why this happens, and Microsoft unfortunately can't prepare for all of these different scenarios, so it does happen once in a while. Unfortunately, Microsoft doesn't give you the option to just flick a switch and then disable those automatic updates. So there are actually some kind of creative ways that you have to go about disabling these updates. Now, the first way that you can do this is you can set your connection, your internet connection, your home Wi-Fi as a metered connection. Now, what that means is that the connection is recognized as being something where you have to pay based on your actual data usage. So when you set a connection as metered, this disables certain types of downloads that happen automatically. So app updates and system updates are automatically disabled when you have your connection set as a metered connection. So what you want to do to set a connection as a metered connection is go to your settings and then go to network and inter internet, excuse me. And then when you're connected to the Wi-Fi network that you want to change to metered, click on advanced options and then just set this connection as a metered connection. All right, the second way that you can stop Windows 10 automatic updates is to stop the Windows update service that runs in the background of your machine all the time. To do this, go ahead and enter your Cortana or search bar and type run. And then in the run box, just go ahead and enter services.msc. When you hit enter, a list of services should appear. Now you wanna go ahead and find the Windows Update service. So you can see I have mine right here. And then double click on that to open it. And then you can see right now it says service status is running. What you wanna do is hit stop. At the same time, you also want to switch the startup type to disabled so that this service doesn't restart every time that you reboot your system. All right, the third way that you can stop Windows 10 updates will stop these updates entirely, which isn't really recommended because a lot of these updates are there to protect you from known sources of malware and viruses and things like that. Uh, but if you do want to do it, you can go to the group policy editor by just typing group policy or edit group policy into the search and then go navigating to that area. Then you wanna to go to the administrative templates folder and then all settings. Scroll down for a bit and you'll eventually find configure automatic updates. So go ahead and double click on configure automatic updates and then it should be on enabled. If you just switch that to disabled and then say apply, that will go ahead and disable all automatic updates. Now it should be noted that this particular setting will only be available to people or will only work for people who are on either the Windows 10 Education Enterprise or Windows 10 Pro SKUs. So if you're on the Windows 10 Home or Home Premium SKUs, this will not work for you. All right, and the last way that you can disable Windows 10 updates is to actually download a program from Microsoft that will allow you to do this. You can easily find this in the bottom of this post if you're watching on the website or if you click on the link in the description of this video if you're watching on YouTube. So you'll navigate to this blog post and down at the bottom of this page, you'll have a link that will take you to that program, which then you can uh, go ahead and download and Microsoft will have instructions on their website that will enable you to do that. If you are watching this on YouTube and you need a little bit of help, there are detailed instructions on the website right on the blog post associated with this video. So go ahead and click on the link in the description if you need a little bit more help. That's it. Thanks for watching.